So question two, we're going to factor. It says to use the trial and error method, but we're just going to factor it like we know how. Trial and error method means just guess and check. And that's always an option. It just takes a while. So first thing, look for greatest common factor. Three and nine both divide by three, but 28 does not. So there's not a greatest common factor. So our next step is to identify A, B, and C. A is 3, B is 28, and C is 9. And we multiply A times C. So 3 times 9 is 27. And we're going to find factors of 27 that add or subtract to 28. So, oh, my first one works. You always do one times that number. Sometimes you use it, sometimes you don't. And then there's three and nine. But this time we actually want one plus 27. So I'm gonna rewrite this over here. The next step is to take this one and 27 and put X's with it and rewrite that middle term. So instead of 28, we're going to have 1x plus 27x. And then the 9 and the 3x squared come down. So we just rewrote the middle. And then the next step is to group the first two and group the second two and take out the greatest common factor. So we're just focusing on 3x squared plus 1x. What's the greatest common factor? 3 and 1. You can't take anything out from 3 and 1. But these both have an x. So we're going to take out the x and factor it out. So when we take out the x, we're left with 3x because we took out an x. And then here we took out the x, so we just have 1. Okay, next, 27x and 9, what's the greatest common factor? Well, they both don't have an x, so no x, but 27 and 9 both divide by 9. So we're going to take out a positive 9, and we're left with 3x plus 1. So you know you're doing this correctly when these are the same. If these are not the same, something's wrong. And then our factored form is what we took out, x plus 9 times this one that's doubled once, 3x plus 1. So if you want to check your work on these, you can. That's the guess and check method. So x times 3x, 3x squared, x times 1 is x. 9 times 3x is 27x. 9 times 1 is 9. And look, this is this. These are the same. That's why we have to group that way. And then the middle two combine to 28x. So that does work, x plus 9. 3x plus 1.